Hi, this is Drew Vernon with the F Expansion BFD team, and today I would like to take you through some things related to the BFD3 browser. This area on the left is the browser, and the first tab is for loading presets. The first thing you're going to want to look at are these buttons across the top. These relate to whatever aspect of the preset you wish to load. So if we have the kit, the mix, and the groove enabled, we're only going to load those aspects. Key, auto and global are not going to load because they are not active. We can scroll up and down using the mouse wheel in the browser and we can double click on a preset to load it. And as you can see we've loaded grooves, we've loaded our mixer and we've loaded our kit. If we come over here to the kits browser we can do a very similar thing. If I click this library filter and filter down to BFD Oblivion, I will only see kits related to BFD Oblivion. And of course, I could double click one of these to load it into my current preset. And as you can see, we have the exact same mix. We have the same grooves, but our kit pieces are now different. If we come over to the drums browser, and if we select a channel in the mixer, you can see that the filtering in the browser changes. And we can click on any of these kit pieces to preview it in place. And if we like what we hear, we can click the tick button to commit and load that kit piece. And that right there is the very basics of browsing. We shall see you in the next video.